Hey YouTube, what's poppin'? It's your girl. Happy Sunday, happy fun day. Uh, hopefully it's a fun day for y'all. Hopefully y'all don't have to work or anything. Hopefully it's a good day. Hopefully it's all day off. Um, but we left off with income, so we gonna get straight into the video. Um, income, so my increasing financial status reflects my changing beliefs about income. I bless my income with love and watch it grow. My income is perfect for me. Every day I love myself a little more. And as I do, I find that I am open to new avenues of income. Prosperity comes through many forms and channels. It is not limited. Some people limit their income by saying that they they live on a fixed income, but who fixed it? Some people feel that they don't deserve to earn more than their fathers earned or to go beyond their parents' worthiness level. Well, I can love my parents and still go beyond their income levels. There is no, there is one infinite ener, or infinite universe and out of it comes all the income that everyone makes. The income I am presently making reflects my beliefs and my deservability. It has nothing to do with getting, it's really allowing myself to accept. I accept a healthy flow of income for myself. And then we talked about... Um, just kind of like going into the law of attraction and um a little bit into like manifestations about how you know it really is true when they said my income reflects my you know like my what i'm attracting like my worthiness my deserving because although all of us deserve a really good income all of us don't believe that ourselves so all of us don't talk about ourselves or talk about income in a high standard in a high manner so a lot of people will be like oh no i've been manifesting i wake up every morning and i'm like i deserve money money is attracted to me da, 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 da. but then they go to work and they're complaining because they're like bro this job doesn't pay me enough to be doing all this uh, da, 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 da. or i don't have enough money for this da, 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 da. and it's just like what you're saying you know you might say to yourself in the mirror that you deserve this or you have that but what your really, what your true beliefs are, what your true intentions are, are are elsewhere. You're elsewhere, and really fixating and focusing on the fact that you don't have enough money to do something, and saying, "Oh, I don't have enough money to do that," or this or that. Like you're attracting not, you're attracting that income. You're attracting not having enough money. You're attracting no money. You're not attracting money. So instead of saying things like, "Oh, I don't have enough money to do that." You know, you can choose to say, oh, instead of spending my money on that right now, I'm going to spend my money on other things or I'm going to spend my money on more important things in my life at the moment, because really that's how you're going to end up attracting more more money, more income, you know, better, better financial abundance is the way that you're talking and speaking about money, about, you know, how you deserve money, how you make money, how you get money. Um, and then it also comes along with two, you know, like. Are you guys just getting a job or are you trying to find multiple streams of income? And I feel like that's like the move right now for like this generation is finding multiple streams of income. Like we're and we all know this, like is the the price to just just be alive, like just to be alive, just to just to drink water, like just to eat some food, just to sleep somewhere is like through the fucking roof, like through the roof. So it's just like. I feel like a lot of people are fixated on, oh, focusing on, up on raising minimum wage or working all these hours when it's just like, why don't we find, why don't we be smarter about it and find multiple incomes? Like really, you know, just trying to put y'all on. There is a lot of different ways, you know, you can find multiple incomes, even online. Like guys, we are blessed as a generation to have the power to, you know, really have this technology to have apps to make money on so we should use them to our full advantage um and then just back to income and i want to reread that i really like this one so i want to kind of elaborate on it a little bit more than what i have been um but you know saying like well i can love my parents or family and still go beyond their income level um there is one infinite universe and out of that comes all of the income that everyone makes and you know and i feel like income also doesn't reflect on money but it reflects on your self-worthiness you know how you think about yourself how you feel about yourself how you talk about yourself all of that because like i said yesterday thoughts are still things words um you know are obviously you know words are very powerful you can speak things into existence without knowing and that even goes along with humor even joking about oh i don't have enough money for all that or this and that like 
you know, your your conscious state of mind, your your mind in general, the universe, it doesn't know, it doesn't it doesn't have a sense of humor. So you joking about something or even just joking about, you know, like homeless people or anything like that, you are attracting that energy. Just so y'all know. But we gon' we gon' we gonna see what we get up next. We're gonna see what we get up next year. Let's see. Ooh, okay. So peace. I choose a peaceful way of life. Peace begins with me. If I want to live a life, I, if I want to live a peaceful world, then it is up to me to make sure I am a peaceful person. No matter how others behave, I keep peace in my heart. I declare peace in the midst of chaos and madness. I surround my I surround all difficult situations with peace and love. I send thoughts of peace and all troubled parts of the world. I want, if I want the world to change for the better, then I need to change the way that I see the world. I am now willing to see life in a very positive way. I know that peace begins with my own thoughts. As I continue to have, have peaceful thoughts, I am connected with like-minded, peaceful thinking people. Together, we will help bring peace and plenty to our world. I really like this one. I really like this one. I've always been, I always, I always loved like, like growing up, even like I always just like y'all, if y'all know, if y'all know me growing up, like I always wore peace signs, like peace signs were my thing. That was my sign because I always just loved the concept of peace, like world peace. But I did have to take a step back and focus that that all starts with you. And that all starts with how you view the world as well. And, um, you know, I really like when it said, you know, like, I know that peace begins with my own thoughts. As I continue to have peaceful thoughts, I am connected with like-minded, peaceful thinking people. And that's very true. You know, the people that you hang out with and the people that you surround yourself are also a reflection of you as a person and how you um, present yourself and project your energy and talk about yourself and think about yourself. Um, the people that you surround yourself with really reflect that. Um, I think that's a good thing to, you know, really, you know, take a step back sometimes and really look at your group of people that you surround yourself with and really evaluate not only them, but like how, you know, how they act, how they, you know, how they speak, how they think, because that's exactly, you know, that's a reflection of you. And, you know, I think peace, the word, the meaning, um, is something like self-love you have to wake up and work on it every day i'm not gonna sit here and say i'm a per perfect person um i definitely can say you know and like I i'll e you know i'll even be 100 percent transparent with you guys like it's certain situations where i react solely out of my initial react and then react with peace and um i'm still working on it i can say that you know i i react more in a peaceful manner now because I've been working on it, but I do have times where I react just off of an initial reaction and don't react off of peace. Um, and, you know, it goes with, you know, it goes with what I was just saying about income thoughts are things, you know, you, you, when you speak, you're speaking everything into existence and your, your, your mind, the universe, it, like it, everything up here, it doesn't have a sense of humor. So how you um talk about things even just like how you talk about other people um you know really re really really um reflects you but it also like you absorb that energy as well so like you know like I really try to be cautious um you know I don't I'm not the type to talk about other people but if I am talking about other people I only talk about other people in a peaceful manner like oh wow she's really pretty or oh my gosh like she out here doing her shit like you know because that's the energy that I want that's the energy that I want to attract you know I don't I don't give off hateful negative energy because I don't want you know I don't want that for myself either you know so um I just, I like that it says I choose a peaceful way of life because, you know, peace is a choice. It's not, you know, it's not really like you just, you know, you're born with it, like, or anything like that. I mean, you technically are when you're a kid because when we're kids, we're peaceful and, you know, we're, you know, we're so happy. But, you know, like, it's a choice. Like, you have to choose to, like, want better in life. You have to choose to want to be peaceful. You have to choose to want to show love. If you choose, like, everything in life is a choice. So if you choose to be a negative person, if you choose to you know, talk about people in a certain way. If you choose to have, you know, a negative sense of humor, 
you're choosing the lifestyle for yourself. You're choosing unhappiness. You're choosing negativity. You're choosing, you know, not peacefulness. You know, like you're 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 choosing the lifestyle that you have. Um, but you know, guys, you already know what it is. We're gonna get back into peace tomorrow. Peace is motivational Monday. Ooh, it's motivational Monday tomorrow, guys. Ooh, it's motivational Monday tomorrow. So I'm about to do something real. I'm about to do something a little different. I'm gonna switch it up for this next week, but. I'm gonna let y'all go. Have a good sat su Saturday. Have a good Sunday. Have a good Sunday. Um, you know, relax or eat good or spend time with people you love or work if you gotta make money and just have a good day and remember to keep peace on your mind and peace out.